Hello everyone. In this video, I will be showing you how to use buttons on your Jimdo ePortfolio. Buttons have a unique feature in that you can use them as a link to pages or documents that you'd like to have on your Jimdo ePortfolio. So we're going to go to your ePortfolio and click on Add Element in the center of the page. And you'll see right here it says button. If you click on button, you will have three different styles that you can use. Yours may not look entirely like mine because of the theme I chose when I first created my ePortfolio. But you can see there's not much of a difference. There's style one, style two, style three. It's whatever you would like. And you can also have it on the left, center it, or put it on the right. It's up to you. I'll put it on the left for now. And the, like I said before, the purpose of a button is to link to another page or document. So if you click on link right here, it brings up this menu. And you'll notice that this is very similar to when you're creating a hyperlink with text. So internal page means it's going to link to another page within your website. This can be useful because if you click in your button, and you were to highlight it and say you were to rename this instead of it saying new button you said back you could then hyperlink it to the coursework page or any other page that you wanted to go back to so whoever is visiting your ePortfolio could click on the button and it would just easily take them to the last page that they were on or you could have it go to any other page. You could click on outside the classroom and you could just rename this button outside the classroom. And hit save. You can also with links click on external link and just put a URL to a page that you'd like to put in the ePortfolio or click on file download and click on the file that you'd like to have them upload when they click on the button. These are the different ways that you can set a link on your button. Always click save and that is it for this training. I hope it's been helpful and I'll see you all in the next video.